On the weekend after the Russian assault on Ukraine began, Andrzej Bergs, founder and CEO of Warsaw-based 3D printing firm Cygnus, heard from his industry friends at 3D Tech Group in Lviv. With their country under attack and all kinds of supplies needed, Pablo Yesup and Mihail Shulgin asked, could Bergs help supply 3D printers of materials to fill the gap? We said, okay, we can do this for you, no problem, says Bergs, whose own relatives live in countries including Poland, Ukraine. It's obvious for us that it's in our common interest to defend Ukraine against Russia. Soon, he filled a bus with 20 printers and more than 800 pounds of the raw printing material called filament to send across the border to Lviv in western Ukraine. The journey was arduous, and after being stopped at the border for three days, Bergs recalls, one of the guys who helped drive there got a tattoo of the bus to remember the moment. In more time, 3D printing is hugely helpful because of its flexibility and speed, which reduces the logistical nightmares of transporting needed supplies. Many 3D printers are relatively small and can be set up in basement bunkers, ideal for wartime production. Then, too, the technology allows parts to be produced at scale in multiple locations at a time and for the designs for parts to be shared digitally among multiple facilities or individual producers, making it, in some sense, designed for use during a crisis or war. The printers that Cygnus sent to Ukraine print polymers or plastics, allowing the production of protective equipment, tourniquets, periscopes and other needed supplies. But getting the printers to Lviv was just the start. Simultaneously, two other Poles involved in the technology industry had been working on how to use their capabilities to help Ukraine. Agnes Kukrons, who runs a non-profit called Teen Crunch that helps teens build startups, figured she could use her organizing savvy in the tech community to create a bigger 3D printing effort. She soon teamed up with her friend Alex Shishak. Founder and CEO of 3D printing startup 3 in Mind, and Bergs, who had previously been a mentor at Team Crunch. Together, they started an initiative called Tech Against Tanks, feeding off the comment by Ukrainian Minister of Digital Transformation Mihailo Fedorov that tech is the best solution against tanks. The three figured that they could do more than just send a one-time supply of printers to Lviv. 